Hello everyone, my name is Alejandra Corbada and today I'm going to show you five tips in Excel that you should know. First, I'm going to add totals to the columns and to the rows. So I'm going to select all the numbers and I'm going to include the column the, for the totals and the rows as well. So I'm going to press and hold control and select the, the next one and the next one. Okay. Remember that you also need to select where you want the totals to go. So once I selected all of them, I'm going to press Alt equal. And now I have the totals for, uh, by column, by row. So that quick and easy, all of them at the same time. Next one, here I have a range of information. You can see the columns they are very, very small. And also I have issues with the rows. Okay. Well, what I'm going to do, I'm going to press Control asterisk to select the whole range. So I need to select a cell inside of the range and then press control asterisk. And then I'm going to press Alt H O I. Now I have the columns properly. Let's go with the rows. Alt H O A. There we go. Now we have our uh, information properly uh, adjusted. Next. Uh, let's highlight the formulas that I have inside of this range. I'm going to press Control Asterisk again to select the whole range. I'm going to go, I'm going to uh, press Control G, the shortcut for go to. I'm going to select Special. I'm going to select Formulas. I'm going to say OK. Now, these are the cells with formulas. I can just select a color here. And now I have highlighted only those cells that have a formula in. So look, all of them have a formula. Perfect, that quick and easy. And now that we are with Control G, I'm gonna go to the next tab and now I want to highlight the errors. So let me zoom in a little bit. Same thing inside of my range, Control asterisk to select the whole range, Control G, select special. I'm gonna select formulas again. I'm gonna remove all the check marks, I'm gonna keep only errors. I'm gonna say, okay, now I have the error selected, select the color, there you go, you have all the errors. In my case, I have very small uh, amount of data, but there are times that we have a very big amount of data and it's very hard for the eye to identify all the errors, right? So this is a very good technique for that. And the last one is one of my favorites. Every time that you want to write something in several cells at the same time. It can be a formula, it can be text, it can be numbers. Select a range, press and hold control and select everywhere that you want that text or that formula or that number to go. In my case, I'm gonna say hello and control enter. And then you have all that information enter in those cells. Excellent. And that's all that I have for you today. If you like this video, please give the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And also share with anybody that you believe can benefit from it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.